Hello everybody, welcome back to another video, and if you want your scratch editor to look like this, then stay tuned because I'm going to be showing you just how to do that. So first you want to do is make a new tab in any browser really. I'm pretty sure any browser can work with the app. And search up Turbo Warp and then download. Okay, so click on the first link and then you'll be on to this page here. So. If you have a Windows computer, then you want to click Windows. If you have a Mac computer, Mac OS, Linux, and yeah. B web app is actually, if you don't want it to be an actual app, it's, it'll just be in your tabs. So I personally have a Windows computer, so what you want to do is click window, uh, Download for Windows. Download that. There it is, right there. Okay, once Turbo Warp is finished downloading, what you want to do is go to Files. And then go to downloads, and your most recent download would probably say Turbo Web Setup. Dot whatever the version is. Dot exe. Want to click on that, and then you'll probably and then this will pop up. So what you want to do is want to go. Don't read this. It's a bunch of stuff. Just click. A, I agree, and then click. So so it could say here anyone who uses a computer all users or only for me which is your the account you're using and then you can do anyone i recommend doing only for me then what you want to do is you want to click next and install okay once it's done installing you'll be um here what you want to click is finish also i'm going to run turbo warp finish and then you'll be greeted with the turbo warp app little button right there you can click it on and off and add on so you can basically control a lot of stuff and i'll do a, a whole other video on add-ons in a little bit well anyways that's gonna be the end of the video i uh, hope you enjoyed and i hope this video helped you somewhat and yeah peace